Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's literally been like forever since the last time I vlogged. The last vlog was the Paris vlog. If you haven't seen it already, go check it out. So we've got like so much to catch up on. The first week of November, took a trip to Paris for my 35th birthday, which was literally like the best birthday experience I could have ever asked for. But the day before we actually took the trip, we moved into a new apartment, which I absolutely love. More on that a little bit later. But then came back and was like unpacking boxes for like weeks and then hosted our families for Thanksgiving. So November was crazy. And then for December, so if you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me over on Instagram. But I started a Reels challenge last year called Reels Miss, which was really my spin on Vlogmas. Last year I didn't have a YouTube channel. And this year I obviously have a channel, but was not like prepared to do Vlogmas at all. So it's a reel every single day in the month of December leading up to Christmas. So up to Christmas Eve. So I've been like filming every pretty much every single day in the month of december we're like currently days away from christmas so november was crazy december has been crazy but we're here we are here we are back one of my goals for 2023 is like to really take youtube by storm and to become way more consistent over here so get ready for that hold me accountable you'll be seeing a lot more of me uh, over here on YouTube. So currently we are days away from Christmas and I've really been just like in the home space, making this house into a home, buying new furniture, sort of like rearranging old furniture that I had over from the old apartment. But yeah, like that's kind of like what we're doing today. I recently purchased a new bed which came in the other day so hopefully we'll put that together i hope that's on the list for today some home stuff i have some shooting to do so it'll just be like i'm just gonna bring you guys along with me to the for the day no formal plan for the day but um yeah i'll bring you guys along with me and we'll see how the day goes okay so there is the box frame in those boxes right there um, super simple keeping everything in this house like really minimal um, and I can't even like show you guys because it's like these boxes are like huge um, but I will definitely show you guys what it looks like once we put it together so I went to home this and I grabbed like these containers to organize my um, like linen linen closet I guess um, to like put like some of like my beauty products and stuff like that in there and then these I grabbed for probably like the bathroom drawers um, I think that's what I'm gonna use these for and then I found this like gorgeous gorgeous coffee table book I have like an obsession with coffee table books especially like any book that is like you know new in the neutral family i will probably pick it up but home goods has just been winning with coffee table books um i've never seen this book before but it's super pretty it's like a beige linen material i'm not sure where i'm gonna put it yet but um very very happy with this um this this pickup and it looks like what's inside will be like really nice sometimes you buy coffee table books you never open them but um just from, like the picture in the front and in the back i think i'm really gonna love like these photos as like home info so I'm very excited for that okay so i am prepping a my reel for today i filmed it last night um but i need to create the real cover for it I put covers on all my reels so i need to create a real cover for it and then um prep the caption because I'm about to like go out and film and I don't want to be like thinking about that while I'm doing it. Let me get this thing together and prep this reel. So I do my reel covers in Canva and I just like use the same template over and over again. Actually, let me, let me show you. Okay, so don't mind my millions of tabs or my light, but this is my real cover. This was the last reel that I did, and I just used like these black bars at the top and bottom. This is a nine by 16 
um, size frame, the same size that fits for um, stories. And I just have like the black bars at the top and the bottom. I put my handle at the bottom um, just to have my name. And then I give my reels like a little bit, a little title. So this was like the last reel I did with Dyson. And then I, I pop it in an image here. So my images don't always correspond with my video. Um, I mean, it's great if they do, but the reality is I'm not always like shooting a photo when I am doing a reel. So sometimes they don't match. A lot of times they don't match, but I don't really care that much. So this reels challenge has been like kicking my behind. Um, I'm so, and I'm such a perfectionist, like I'm such a perfectionist and that is like one of the reasons why I do this challenge because um, it forces you to, um, you know, really take on done is better than perfect. Now it doesn't remove the um, desire um, for like perfection, right? It doesn't remove that desire, but it's like you don't have time when you're putting out reels every single day especially the type of reels that i create which are more um i guess more cinematic and it's more like a buzzword going around right now but like they take a lot of time you know they they take a lot of time um so you don't have time to be like so meticulous um which just forces you to like get it done and move on to the next thing um, so I still uphold my standards, obviously. I still have my standards of like what, you know, what I will create and what I won't create, but it, it forces you to like not get stuck, which is a problem that I have. Um, however, it has been like kicking my behind. Um, so I'm glad for everything that this challenge brought. I do feel like um, I have grown skill-wise, like my skills are expanding and now like I'm using lights and just really just understanding my camera better, understanding my equipment better and just understanding like the craft a little bit better. Um, so I'm grateful for um, that, that I feel like I gained during this challenge. And also even in like storytelling, I feel like my storytelling has gotten a little bit deeper and broader and I've been able to like step outside of my comfort zone. So I'm like really, really grateful for the challenge. But again, I'm going to be grateful with silver for sure. I also had a sponsor post go live yesterday so i have to send over the insights um after 24 hours like for my story insights um so i have to i have to do that today as well and send over that with the invoice um so i'll probably work on that in a bit i like despise sending invoice like that's just that whole like process it's just tedious and um, not something I look forward to, but very necessary, especially to get your coins if you want them on time. And I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I use QuickBooks just to like keep track of um, all of my invoices and um, payments. So like even if I'm doing something that I'm not sending an invoice, um, like a partnership that I'm not sending an invoice, like with like like to know it, I get a lot of partnerships through like to know it or like influencer platforms, you don't typically send invoices. I still keep everything in there just to help me keep track of like all the payments that are supposed to come in so I don't lose track of anything. Um, so I have to like go through there, update, make sure that like, you know, brands are not late on payments and stuff like that. I'm gonna draft um, that reel now. Ooh, I can't wait for you guys to see it. Like I've been using this um, new light, like my apartment, I, I absolutely love it here, but I don't get as much natural, like consistently 
throughout the house as I did in my old spot, like my office right now. I'm in my office and I get, there's no windows in here, so I have no natural light. And so I had to invest in a light. So I'm like using outside lighting for the first time, which has been an adjustment, but it also is like allowing me to like create more moody vibes because I'm controlling the light and I'm like absolutely loving it. Like it's just, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Um, I still do prefer natural light always. I, I think I will always prefer to shoot with natural light, but um, you know, there's just certain things that natural light will not get you. And so my reel that I'm posting today is like super like, moody and vibey and I, I love it. It's simple, but it's it's vibey and I love it. I think I'm gonna tear the brand in. How do you spell, how do you spell Reese's? R-E-S-E? R-E-E, Reese's. All right, draft is complete. Um, I'll probably post that around like four or five o'clock since it's like moody vibes. Say hi to the vlog. Hey vlog, make sure you watch. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't. Okay, on to the next thing. Bed today. No bed today. I did buy sheets though. I bought sheets from Target. I do need to buy pillows. I need to buy pillows. Um, king size pillow. What? Born? Joey, we don't have to watch it every time. Which one is this one? No, ultimate is left and right. No. Supremacy. No. <laughs> no, those are that's the second and third one. But so ultimate there's a, fourth one and there's a fifth one. There's a fifth one? Yeah. yeah. What is it? Wait, did we see that? I don't know. He's like, I don't know about you, but I saw it. Dang, how are you just watching movies without me? Which one is this? The fourth one? I never even knew that there was
was four and a five. Stop what? But why are you still having on? We can watch something else. I do like the movies. I just don't like to watch them every single time that they're on TV. What was I saying? Uh, yes, pillows. pillows. Need to get king size pillows. Um, I really like the pillows that I have now, but they're queen, like standard size. So, um, Amazon. Also, a new comforter. The one that I have now is like, I always sweat. Like every night I feel like I sweat too much. So I need to get like a, a lighter weight one. Almost time for dinner. Mm -hmm. She said the table. The table? I got that. I'm, I'm, gonna, set, I'm gonna set up for this reel. Let me do that now.